Good afternoon, my friends, and thank you for joining me for another shave. Today's shave is brought to you by Strike Gold Shaves Old Hickory. Um, only used this a couple of times. It uh, smells nice. I like it. In that, in that respect, I'm using the first anniversary uh, uh, Sorrentino brush. And today's razor is one from out of left field. I've got a Lady Gillette because it's so blamed hot out there I need as mild a razor as I can find because I've been outside and I don't want to, to uh, upset myself any more than I already am from being outside. Two weeks ago we had frost for crying out loud and now we got you know 85 degrees. My body cannot adjust that fast. I am not a reptile. So, we uh, have been shopping, Corvette shopping for a lot of you guys who, who know me on the cadre. I've been looking for a, another car and one that I can drive for a while. Wife unit only threw down a couple of of absolutes. She says this this will not happen unless a it's a car you don't have to do a lot of work on. B isn't expensive, and C we can ride in for long distances and stuff. So we put all the things together, and my neighbor being a car guy, we decided that a Corvette would be probably ideal. And so we've been searching. Problem is, my price range is a little bit restrictive. So, we are kind of stuck. The, guy, the one I found that was right at the tippity top of my price range, nice car, looked better in pictures than it did in person. But I took some more detailed pictures over to my expert. And he says those are nothing to really worry about so long as it's running good. And he comes down a little bit to help me with tires. Because the tires from reading the codes were made in 2000. So yeah, 20 year old tires are probably not a good idea. Hey Chad, guess what I have in mind? <laughs> I got four days of growth. Another reason I thought, thought I'd use a fairly mild razor. Am I reasonably even? It looks reasonably even. It feels nice with the cool water. This shit, this uh, soap works well with cold water. A lot better than I expected. It's the the lather isn't as high as if I when I use hot water. I don't know. It's either I'm not uh, I'm not using the same technique, or maybe I don't know. It just isn't as peaky as it normally is. I'm leaving this lather on here just so that uh, something like that um, soften what it is in there because mommy's not going to be too happy about me growing additional facial hair. I did it several years ago for a musical. Um, I was a rabbi in. Uh, Fiddler on the Roof on our local local uh, community theater. I think it was just a non-complicated part that they needed a base for. and That would put me on the in the right places.
So we'll see what. But it took. It seemed like it took me months to come up with a, a lot of beard. I don't have a lot on my cheeks. I got a little tuft here. But that's about it. We'll see how it works out. I'll give it another couple few days. and If it itches or anything, the first sign of discomfort is coming off. Very impressed to see... Uh, uh, first head shave, uh, Kentucky, Dave in Kentucky shaved his head. He's got a nicely shaped head. I've looked from the side. His, head, his head's got nice symmetry to it. I don't know if he's gotten comments about that or compliments, but you have a nicely shaped head, Dave. Well, you rock that. There are some... Uh, products it can be used to cut the shine down a little bit maybe just talcum powder will be fine I uh, shaved my head once to support a lady in the choir who had cancer and she lost her hair, so I shaved my head so that she wouldn't be all alone. I don't know how many shades are on this on this uh, blade, but it's doing pretty good. Post pass slickness for uh, this soap is pretty good. Not king of the hill, not top of the heap, but still pretty good. And then just in the hollows of my neck and a little bit here, but it's got enough slickness that I can just whip out the few little cleaning strokes. And there we have it. Oh, let's rinse this off and see how we did. Well, from looking at the things, it looks like I'm at about an eighth of an inch. So, in eight days, you might be able to see that I'm doing a little something down there on my chin. The wife will start complaining probably well before that. Lady Gillette pre performed just, it feels just like a blue tip, only it's got a longer, uh, a little longer handle a little sl more slender handle too that doesn't bother me any no cuts no runs no errors so I think we're in good shape now the aftershave Doesn't say a whole lot about it. Let's see what, because you can see it's nearly full. I think I've only used the soap maybe once, maybe twice. So well, it's got a quite a constrictor on it. So it means business. Got a pretty good alcohol hit. No menthol. I think once the alcohol burns off, it'll be fairly mild not much in the way of a projection or anything this is just strictly an antiseptic with a little bit of smell kind of an aftershave which is fine um, and that's basically all that's going on in my life I hope uh, this being Monday your week 
turns out great it turns out the way you want it to I am Major Rich you will find me on the shavingcadre.com and uh, I will see you next time bye bye